Hello engineers, welcome back to Engineering Design Simplified. In this video series, I will discuss principle of virtual work applied for beams. Today's problem is a simply supported beam with uniformly distributed load. So here a beam AB of length L and a uniformly distributed load of W Newton per meter is applied from uh, throughout the length of the beam. So in this problem, we need to find reactions at A and B using principle of virtual work. Let us see in the coming slides how to solve this problem. To find reaction at B or B, let us give a virtual displacement of delta B at B. So the beam will assume this position A B prime. So this displacement is delta B and at end A delta A equal to 0. So now let us apply uh, principle of virtual work. So let us write virtual work equation. So virtual work equation can be written as minus W into L that is total load into the average displacement that is delta A plus delta B by 2 plus RB into delta B equal to 0. So RB is this reaction and delta B is this displacement. So here negative sign is because W is acting downwards and delta B is given in the positive direction upward direction. So from this uh, equation in this equation delta a equal to 0 so after substituting delta a equal to 0 and simplifying we can get rb reaction at b rb equal to w l by 2 similarly to find reaction at a r a let us give a virtual displacement of delta a at a so the beam will assume this position b a prime so here at b delta b equal to 0 so at a delta a is given here so let us apply principle of virtual work that is let us write virtual work equation so again minus w into l into delta a plus delta b by 2 that is average displacement plus r a into delta a equal to 0 so again negative sign is because w is acting downward direction and uh, delta a is given in the upward direction so positive sign here for r a is uh, r a is acting in the upward direction and delta a is also given in the upward direction so in this equation delta b equal to 0 after substituting delta b equal to 0 and simplifying we get r a reaction at a r a equal to w l by 2 that's all for today's video if you like this content please like share and subscribe thanks for watching